Welcome! It's a great day to be a content creator. Today we're going to discuss the YouTube Partner Program, how to get monetized, and how much you can expect to earn through this program. Our channel recently hit the minimum requirements and we're going to walk you through the entire application process with us in real time. But without further ado, let's spin that intro. Pew! Today we're going to discuss how to get monetized on YouTube. The first thing you have to do is meet your minimum requirements of 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch time hours. Once you have met these requirements, then you can apply for monetization. It took me roughly six months and 30 videos to get to this landmark. All right, so let's start the application process. We're gonna hit apply now and see where it takes us. Step one, review the partner program terms. Read and agree to the U-Term partner program terms. This is an agreement that makes it possible for you to earn money. Let's hit start and reviewing, reviewing, monetization, rev revenues, YouTube, YouTube will pay you. This is interesting here. They will pay you 55% and they will keep 45% of your ad revenues. That's an important key point to know. Um, payment account in order to earn and receive payment of any revenues here under you must at all times have an active AdSense account and that will be one of the next setup items is to set up our AdSense account payment terms limitations and taxes YouTube will pay you for any revenue due within an approximately 60 days after the end of the calendar month so once you meet the payout threshold I believe it's a hundred dollars then you they will pay you within 60 days of the end of that month so do not expect quick payment for revenues earned and especially if you're starting out like me and you probably aren't going to make the amount needed per month to get a payout it's probably going to take two three months to get my first minimum payout so we'll see how that goes termination either party may terminate these terms for convenience within 30 days prior written notice to the other governing law the governing law and dispute resolution provisions of youtube terms of services will apply to these terms da, da, da. i accept email me updates we'll keep that because we want to know any changes in policies so accept terms and voila step one complete step two sign up for google adsense all right let's hit start for google adsense sign up and it says you will be redirected to an adsense to complete this step you need to have an adsense account to start monetization and to get paid do you have an account no i do not have an existing account on the next screen, choose the Google account you want to create an AdSense account with. You will be redirected to AdSense to create the new account. Once you are done, you will be redirected back to YouTube. We're going to continue. And we'll blur this out, but this is my AdSense. Um, this is my Google account. And then it asks for my URL. There's going to be a lot that I'm going to have to gray out through the AdSense account, I'm sure, because I believe it has tax information, uh, payment information, etc., etc. URL of your website. That is your YouTube channel address. And just verifying it's already in there, and that is the correct address. Get more out of AdSense. Yes, send me customized help and performance suggestions. No, do not send me. We're going to go with yes because a little help never hurt anything. Country. United States. Please review and accept our terms and conditions. I sped read all that. Didn't miss a word. And create account enhance 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 enhance, 
Maybe they don't want me to be monetized. Something went wrong. Wow. Okay. Your existing Google Publisher account, you're already linked to an existing Google Publisher account. Continue with this account or use a different. So we're going to continue. Accept association. Now it's asking for payment address details. It wants an account type, individual or business, individual. Uh, and this is where if you're set up as a business, you want to set that up instead. Name. Um, address line. Address, phone number, and submit. Redirecting you to host. And I am redirected. And we've done step one. That should be step two. It's still thinking and it says in progress for Google AdSense sign up. Your AdSense account is being created or associated. The approval or association process can take up to several days. I wish I could have had that already set up. Maybe you can, but I sure didn't. And then once it is complete, I can go to get started for the get reviewed. Get reviewed, step three. YouTube will review your channel to make sure it complies with YouTube monetization policies. We will email you a decision, usually within a month. This step will begin automatically after you complete the first two steps. So I guess as soon as my AdSense account is created and associated, that will start step three, the get reviewed. And I have read somewhere where it said could take up to a month to get reviewed, but I've also seen where it can take up to two to three days. So I'm hoping for the latter. Real quick on the Google AdSense setup, I jumped over into Google AdSense and it says, we are working on setting you up. This usually takes a few days, but in some cases it can take up to two weeks. We will notify you when everything is ready. Then you can start earning money by placing ads. So once Google AdSense is finished setting up, back over to my monetization tab and step three getting reviewed should automatically begin and it should take anywhere from two days up to a month and let's hope it only takes a couple of days. Good morning, good morning. It really is a good morning. Today I woke up less than 24 hours after applying for both my AdSense account and for my YouTube partner program and I have already been accepted and linked for AdSense and been accepted and linked for the YouTube partner program. I got the email first thing in the morning that I was accepted, that I've already been reviewed. And then I jump onto my dashboard and right off the bat at the very top, there's a banner that says, congratulations, you've been accepted into the YouTube partner program. You can now monetize your videos and access support. They have added a new little section over here. It says new place for your important notifications. Here you will find important notifications about your channel, which require your attention. Keep an eye out for new messages and then over here the first notification I got says congratulations you've been accepted into the YouTube partner program you can now monetize your channel and contact support so this is amazing because both the AdSense account said it could expect up to two weeks to be accepted and linked and then the YouTube review said that it could take up to a month to review and I'm sure your mileage will vary depending on your type of content and amount of videos i had 29 videos and my account has been set up for a little less than six months um, so anyway i am set up it's amazing it went super quick super smooth and i'm really excited about it i'll have to go back through and edit out some personal information that i can't share on these once i get this all edited i'll share it with you and hopefully it will ease your mind and help you to apply for the youtube partner program i'm sure i have to still go back in and add some of my payment 
payment information so that I can actually get a payout once I hit the $100 minimum. Um, so that will be amazing. I have a feeling it might take me a couple months because I don't have a huge uh, volume yet I'm only up to about 6,000 watch time hours which is actually pretty good since you need 4,000 minimum and I'm hit over 2,000 extra hours just trying to get my thousand subscribers once I got my thousand subscribers and then I instantly applied that same day and here we are already approved in less than 24 hours Bravo YouTube thank you thank you Thank you. Okay, so let's go ahead and start to monetize the videos process up at the very top banner that I said says congratulations You have been accepted into the YouTube partner program You can now monetize your videos and access support right up here this pretty blue banner. We're going to click monetize videos and then it will jump over into our creator content. Um, it says set monetization preferences. Do you want to monetize existing videos? Of course we do. Be sure the videos comply with advertiser friendly guidelines. I know that all of my videos will meet with these guidelines. I do not have children in my videos. I do not swear. I do not have any questionable content or any violence and anything of that nature. So I want to monetize all videos next the ad settings these preferences will also be applied to all future uploads you can change them at any time at settings upload defaults and monetizations types of ads so this will be interesting let's see what types there are several types of ads that may appear on or around your video. You can maximize earning potential by turning on all ad format. Display ads are shown by default because they do not interrupt your video. So obviously we cannot change the display ads. It is on by default right here, this grayed out box. So next, overlay ads and sponsored cards. I think what we're going to do is we're going to include all types out of the gate. We're going to go and watch some of the videos and find out how intrusive they are. And if they could affect engagement or retention, we may move some of these back off because at this stage in my YouTube, I would rather not have to lose any um, audience retention. Um, it's very important to build up. So the pennies I would earn from the extra ad revenue probably wouldn't be worth losing possible subscribers or possible future clicks. So we're going to go ahead and turn them all on and then see how that functions. So, so there is display ads, overlay ads, sponsored cards, skippable video ads, non-skippable video ads. And now it says location of video ads. You can change the position of these video ads if your video is over eight minutes. If you choose a during video, allow a couple of hours for ad breaks to be generated. So mid roll ad breaks will be set up automatically. You can change them later. From what I'm hearing is these ads are gonna roll regardless of whether you turn them on. So you should turn them on so that you're getting ad revenue. So then we're going to apply our new preferences. Updating videos. It is safe to navigate away and now wait before making another bulk update. So that's amazing. It is now applying my ad preferences to all of my existing videos. I have 29 videos on here and like I said it took me around six months to reach the 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch time hours. I did hit clear up to 6,000 watch time hours and the watch time wasn't a problem for me. I know it is a problem for many others. Some people grab subscribers really quickly. I grew organically and slowly and that's how I got my watch time hours way up but did not get the subscriber count as quickly. So I hope this will help you or someone else to get through the monetization process. And it really was easy. It really was seamless. The only thing I have left to do is go in and set up my payment information. And look at that. 
33 of 33 videos successfully updated. I said earlier that I had 29 videos. I have 29 real videos and 29 live videos. One last thing, I went ahead and refreshed my channel content page. Here's what it looked like right here and notice the column for monetization is off all the way down. Now I reload the dashboard and look at that. Monetization is on for all of my videos. Welcome to the YouTube Partner Program. A couple more items we want to look at real quickly. Let's go to look at our monetization tab now and see what it actually looks like. So it has changed, obviously, and it shows how to learn more to earn money from your YouTube channel different ways. It shows monetization options, video advertising, supers, and then it actually shows at the bottom my YouTube partner program options. And I'll have to blur out my AdSense account, but it shows it right down there and the agreements. Now let's go over into analytics because that's what I wanted to see because that's where it should show any kind of revenues as they are coming in. Yep, there it is. It added a revenue tab that didn't used to be there. So let's click the revenue tab. What? I've made no revenue? Well, it just went up, so that's pretty awesome. So it'll be awesome to check. Back. All right, here we are back over into my channel. We're at the main dashboard. This is two days later. This is three days later from the initial application when I first started it. Then I made a follow-up the next day to see what had unlocked and how it looked. And now two days later, so three days total from the date that we began the application, we're going to see what it actually shows because we should have some data now. So this is on the dashboard. Let's jump over into analytics and see what we see. So here's our normal overview. We got 36,380 views in 28 days. Not too bad, all organic natural growth. So we are moving in the right direction. Now let's go over to our revenue tab. And there we go, our first day of actual numbers to base off of. We didn't have any numbers yesterday. I checked it yesterday morning and yesterday evening. So today is our first day of seeing actual data on here. It's showing $4.32 and it's showing that the previous two days are actually still processing. So this was after day one of monetization. I made $4.32 is my cut after all is said and done and it's still approximate but that's what I should get for that day one which was I believe the 29th of March. Today is now the 1st of April. Over here it can show it showed the 29th zero dollars so actually that is for the 30th. For March the 30th my first day of getting paid for monetization I had four dollars and 32 cents worth so that's pretty solid. So let's quickly check in on our monetization process. It's been a couple days now we're going to look at the numbers real quick and then we have an interesting email about AdSense and what we have to do to finish the process to get paid. So let's jump over in this is our dashboard let's hit our analytics tab and then let's go over to our revenue tab and here is our revenue it is showing that we have made eleven dollars and eighteen cents in two days of payout so on 330 we made 431 and on 331 we made 687 not too shabby to start this off with so now let's jump over into this email through google adsense it says that we need to verify our address to receive payments from google adsense they have sent a pen number to our physical address in snail mail once we get that pin number then we have to go and verify our address through Google Adsense it says right here your ads will stop serving if you do not use the pen to verify your address within four months of the date of which the first pen was mailed and this is obvious because Google and YouTube are giant legal entities and they are going to do everything to the letter T of the law and this is the proper way to get payouts so that it is taxed and documented properly through the system. So you have to verify your PIN if you want to get paid. 
all right we're now 10 days into our monetization process from start to where we are we just got our exciting letter in the mail from Google Adsense this contains my pen as it shows up in the top that blue border please sign into your Adsense account to verify your address using the pin code mailed to your billing address this is required to receive future payments if I don't actually go input this pen I probably will not get paid so this is pretty exciting so from start to finish we're gonna be completely set up once I put this pin number in let's go ahead and get some quick numbers on this um, I it shows that I have 6154 but the first day here wasn't a full day it was only 431 so we're gonna take that out divided by we're gonna minus 431 and then we're going to divide it I think that's eight days one two three four five six seven that's eight days of data so we'll divide it by eight days to get a do daily um, revenue of seven dollars and fifteen cents is is what I'm currently making I have eleven hundred and eighty subscribers only thirty one videos so let's see how much that would be extrapolated into an entire year times 365 days and my channel as it stands with less than 1200 subscribers and 31 videos would be making two thousand six hundred and eleven dollars just from the Google Adsense account as a freshly monetized player in the YouTube partner program real quick I'll just show you some of my real-time views and my analytics on how much traffic my small YouTube channel gets so that you can compare to yours to see how much you can expect here's my numbers we're going to go ahead to Google and add in our Adsense pen all right so we hopped over into our Google Adsense account right here it shows your current your payments are currently on hold because you have not verified your address that's what this beautiful little pin number is gonna help us do and right here down at the bottom to do verify your billing address we mailed you a pin on April 2nd it should take two to four weeks to arrive verify your address by entering the pin we set okie doke so let's verify and then we have to input our pin and here's what the Google AdSense letter shows. And here's what it reads. It says, your Google AdSense personal identification number. Welcome to Google AdSense. Your account isn't set up to receive payments yet. Please follow the instructions to verify your address. Sign into your AdSense account and find the pen verification card on the home page. Enter the pen exactly as it appears on the right and click submit. So pretty simple. We're gonna enter our pen. We have three attempts remaining, so don't mess it up three times. Okay, on right, submit. And just like that, my billing address has been verified. Okay, so that's it. That's over in Google AdSense. I've got my PIN number entered, so I have verified my physical address. I've already got my tax information in there. I am fully set up. All right, one last update. Over in Google AdSense, it does show my balance for March of 1121. That was only for the two days. It does not update any of these estimated earnings and all these reports because that is now done in YouTube itself. So if you go under analytics, those are your live numbers. They do not not track in AdSense. AdSense is only keeping the actual deposits coming over from YouTube pending your payouts and shows your payouts there. And I have a balance from last month because I didn't hit the minimum $100 threshold. Once I hit the $100 threshold at the end of that month, then I will get a payout. So that was my final update. Let's run to the outro. <laughs> well, there you have it from start to fully monetize. The whole process only took us a couple of days. Of course, your mileage may vary. To recap, to get to the minimum requirements, it took me roughly six months and about 30 videos. Most users will hit the subscriber count far before they'll ever hit the watch time. But in my case, I had a couple of large hitting and tutorial videos that boosted my watch time well beyond the subscriber count. If you have any questions or comments, make sure to drop them down below in the comments. If you like this video, you know what to do. Smash that like button and subscribe for future content. Thanks for coming along and enjoy the ride. Pew.